In a rare move, some members of the public were cleared out of the lower level of city council chambers Friday following multiple disruptions. That eventually spilled out into the lobby. Josue Sikan was among those demonstrating against a controversial resolution condemning last weekend's attack by Hamas and standing in support of Israel. I don't see this resolution as being proposed in good faith of actually pushing for peace. A special city council meeting was held to discuss the Israeli solidarity resolution proposed by the council's only current Jewish member, Alderwoman Deborah Silverstein. The current conflict and this resolution is not about Israel and Palestine. It is not about one military. It's time now for Chicago to show our unequivocal support. Thoughts on the matter were split during public comment and drew backlash from some city leaders like Alderwoman Rosanna Rodriguez Sanchez, who appeared in the meeting via Zoom. If we are against violence, we are against all kinds of violence, and we need to be in solidarity with our Palestinian brothers and sisters as well. That's not what this resolution says or does. Ultimately, the measure was approved by the council after a voice vote, Mayor Brandon Johnson calling this a very heavy moment for the city. The pain and trauma that has rippled across this world is certainly felt right here in the city of Chicago and amongst all of us. So we are grieving together as a city. Mayor Johnson went on to say that he is praying for safety and peace overseas and asking Chicagoans to do the same. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.